Hey, welcome, 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 everyone. Derek Strickland here, professional speaker, YouTube SEO strategist. I am so glad to be coming to you right now. And uh, man, I got something I want to share. Um, there, there's a lot of buzzwords going around. And one of the buzzwords that I've been seeing is recession, that we are in a recession. And I want to talk about that as it relates to uh, marketing and um, being wise uh, with your marketing dollars. So do me a favor. If you know anyone that is that has a business, a business owner, affiliate marketer, professional speaker, um, if you are a consultant, coach, course creator, um, tag them in this video. I got something I want to talk to them about as it relates to, um, you know, some of the top reasons why organic traffic beats paid traffic during a recession. All right. So um, while you tag them, I want to go ahead and um, uh, say welcome, welcome, welcome to all of my people watching me on YouTube right now. Uh, do me a favor, go ahead and subscribe to the channel, smash that like button, and um, man, put put what type of uh, industry you're in in the comment section. Um, I got really uh, three key points I want to talk to you about, all right, um, as it relates to um, why organic traffic is way better and it beats paid traffic during a uh, recession. And, um, you know, maybe this may help you as it relates to how you plan on spending your marketing dollars going forward throughout this year. Um, one thing you, we have to know is that when you are actually doing paid traffic, it takes money, right? You're testing. And while you're testing, you don't test for free. Like, you have to spend money to run the test, all right, to see how this, uh, maybe this script works or how this video pool uh, you run tests and on colors and how the colors, how people are reacting to this color scheme. All right. So uh, it, all of that takes money. And in a recession, we really want to be as um, careful with our marketing dollars that we don't waste them just testing stuff out and still not coming out with the right answer as to how you should go for your traffic. All right. So organic traffic is uh, more cost effective than uh, pay advertising because it's free, all right? It provides a more sustainable source of uh, website visitors or people um, getting on a Zoom call, a Discover call with you so that you can, you know, figure out if it's a good fit. It can lead to a higher conversion rate and better long-term results. When you're running paid advertising, once your money is done, you're done. Like, your money runs out and your ad is not being seen anymore. Once you do, once you do a uh, YouTube video that is optimized properly, right, and and you have what I call like the five components of a successful video, you got the hook, you got the introduction, you got the um, you got the problem, you got the solution, and you got the call to action. That video is there, and it's gonna stay there to uh, serve your ideal customer forever or as long as you leave it there. All right. Imagine this, like if you had, if you did one video a day, that's 352 videos that are ready to actually serve your ideal customer day in, day out, while you sleep, while you're doing stuff, while you're on your job, while you're on vacation, these videos are actually there to, to do the job by which you sent them out to do, which is either collect leads, get people on a discovery call, or to close a sale. There are people right now in your industry that are what we like to call ready to buy clients. These clients are ready to buy and they're looking for specific videos that are going to ask, answer the questions that they have burning on the inside of their mind right now. There's somebody up right now and they're searching for a question that guess what you got and you got in your head, but because your marketing dollars have ran out and your ad is no longer showing right? <laughs> Your ad is no longer showing and they can't get the information. But if you had a video up there on YouTube that was optimized to talk about that particular question, to give the answer, to provide some value, listen, the internet would pay you in direct proportion to the value that you give it. All right? So if you had these videos there, it's like having your own sales force. And the only thing you had to spend was time to create it. Time to do keyword research. Time to understand your, like, for real, your real avatar. 
like whoever your avatar is, time to understand that individual and to meet their needs and to give them what it is that they need in this time right now via a YouTube video that has been optimized to their likings. Uh, I got a friend, mentor, and a brother um, that told me marketing is the art of communicating based on the customer's need and not yours, right? So when you learn how to do videos that you know that your customer needs, not necessarily videos that you like to do about this awesome, cool thing that you know how to do within your niche, within your industry, right? When you learn how to do videos based off of the customer's need, your, your videos and your advertising will go so much further. They get more views, people start to subscribe to your channel, right? Because if you tell me something that I'm looking for right now and I can get a quick win, guess what? I'm subscribing all day long, right? And once I become a subscriber, once I ring the, uh, click the bell to be notified each and every time you upload a video, guess what? You just had a new subscriber and I'm waiting on your next video because I know you already is delivering valuable content. Opposed to if you get ran paid advertising. Yes, paid advertising to get you in front of the customer really quick. But you got to make it count. All right? It's got to work. It's not no more testing. Right? It's got to work and it's got to convert. So one thing that uh, organic traffic allows you to do is it allows you to test. It allows you to see and look at the analytics inside of YouTube to see exactly what it is that's working and what's not. And it's just as simple as doing more of what's working. All right. So um, organic traffic is going to be paid advertising hands down, especially during a recession when people are trying to watch every little bit of the marketing dollars that they have. Now, if you want to learn how to actually optimize your YouTube videos so that they showing up in search so that your ideal customer can find you and book a discovery call with you so that your ideal customer can find you and buy your product on the, right on the spot, right? So your ideal client can really get to know you, like, and trust you, right? I want to show you how to become a household name and do it with free YouTube videos, all right? There's going to be a link in the comments. It's a discovery link, right? So you click on that link and you book a free call with me and let, let's talk about exactly what it is that you're doing in 2023 and how I can show you how to optimize your YouTube videos to better serve your customers so that you become that household name. All right. So the link is going to be in the comment section right down below and share this video out with anyone you know that is in business because this whole uh, paid traffic versus um, organic traffic. This is something that is talked about and that needs to be talked about right now, especially during the recession, right? I know Facebook ads are, are awesome. You're able to, you know, get in front of a target group, but listen, I can show you how to do that with YouTube and never have to worry about paying for an ad, right? And get all organic traffic because people know you like and trust you. People have actually fell in love with the value that you're given. All right. So look in the com look in the comment section. Um, we're going to put the link to a free um, call. And uh, wow, it's a lot of great things that I got going on with my video rank makers uh, program. We actually have a 30 day boot camp coming up. And uh, once you uh, sign up for a free discovery call with me, we'll discuss that. Also have a um, what I would like to call a white glove service that's getting ready to drop where I'm going to actually help you and uh, give you enough content that you ain't got to worry about nothing but doing the video. All right. So um, there's definitely uh, a lot of great things excuse me, getting ready to come up. That's why I want you to go ahead and subscribe to the YouTube channel. I want you to uh, follow me right here on Facebook or if you're looking at this on TikTok or wherever you're looking at me, I need you to subscribe or follow me on these different platforms, all right? So as always, it's my wish for you that you all be blessed. Then go out there and be a blessing, all right? Talk to you guys later. Peace.